Really? Right on me. What is orange? Is it protection? I can't remember. Oh, fuck off. Come on. It just happens to land exactly where I am. On two occasions. I do so enjoy the cries of torment. Ah. Come on, it's just bullshit. What the? Fuck. Oh, I've somehow fallen through the floor. How I fell through the floor, don't ask me. What? <sighs> That's going to collapse. Enjoying your stay on I know how to spot them now. Yes, Avatar, seek our way home. There, collapse. Yeah. Okay, I thought I'd figured out that that should collapse. Ah, fuck off. I thought I could spot the uh, the tile. Supposed to be going that way. Where the hell am I supposed to be going? What? Why was it? How was I supposed to know there was a teleport there? Just keep going. I don't suppose you're just going to talk to me. Oh, you are! Well, apparently, you nearly completed your test. Fared well, young one. Thank you, Necromancer. The road has been hard. And harder still will it become when I've won. Your final test is at hand. The next Necromancer you seek is Gallius. If you prove yourself worthy, Gallius will provide you with that which you need to gain the audience with the Mountain King. I am a ready Necromancer. Gallus will be the judge of that live one. Now listen carefully. But without my knowledge, you will never live to see Gallus. A necromancer deal is always with death, yet sometimes necromancers must be able to resist death in order to continue to serve his master. Therefore, the time arrives to take wood, dirt, and blackmore to the lords of Vaz and Corp and focus his magic upon yourself. How will I know when to use this soul? That I cannot tell you. You must decide this for yourself, but be warned. 
You only, uh, only use this spell once, therefore use it wisely. I'm just going uh, good fortune upon you, apprentice. I forgot what the fucking. Oh, it's head dirt. Uh, only use it once. Uh, what's he just taught me? Uh, withstand death, that was it. Wood, dirt, black more. One, seeing as I can only cast it once, allegedly. Withstand death. <laughs> oh, Faxman, thanks for the follow. How was your uh, stream? Uh, you were playing Mountain Blade, weren't you? I haven't played that for ages. Oh no, spiders better cast withstand death. <laughs> I can't actually remember how this works. Um, what version of Mountain Blade is it now? What uh, what name is it running under? I can't even remember which one I've got. I mean, I played it when it first came out. When you only had the very basics of uh, battles. Fire and Sword. Is that the latest one? Can't remember what I've got. <laughs> okay, I've got a hat to match my silly head. Get rid of this stupid thing. Sound card clicking away. Ah, right. Yeah, I played that one. I can't even remember which one it was I have got. I'm guessing it's got something to do with that chest. Let me guess. The chest has an explosion so powerful it kills you. That can't be dispelled. Maybe. Ow. I I'm actually not walking into the damn thing. if that's where you're supposed to use it yeah he's been working on it for a long time I actually remember playing it on a laptop in a lodge a Swedish Scandinavian lodge in Scotland in the middle of uh, in fact Halloween it was Met oh, Christ it must have been 10 years ago 
because there was fuck all else to do. It reminded me of Lords of Midnight. Does Mount Blade? Just with having like a party and going around the world and visiting places. supposed to be going here am I supposed to like get killed by that fireball with the resist death spell on Is that what I'm supposed to do what do you say try casting uh, rock skin I can't remember what that was Rock skin, rock skin. Ah, oh, rock flesh wouldn't do it. Something's not right. Ah, oh, because I didn't use fucking wood. Yeah. Let's just use one because I've now only got one pile of fucking dirt left. Probably didn't even need to do that, I could just walk past it, can I? Yow. Seekers. Was quite good. No, no problem. I haven't needed to cast the spell and it's bugging me. I don't know why. I thought that was the test. I thought it, you were sort of blocked, and that's where you had to sort of die, or at least resist death, and then that would be the test. Ooh, hello. I must be missing something because there's been absolutely no need to cast resist death. There must be something else somewhere. Unless you have to cast it before you talk to the necromancer. Does he try and kill you? Kill the troll. I'll come back to you in a minute. Care you no 
more for your own world. Yeah. Right. For God's sake, how many shapes does Dead Man's Elbow come in? It's just stupid. Fuck off. <laughs> the bag gumps are just so big. See the bag before. Ah. Yeah, he'd fallen on top of it. <sighs> Just like this time. Fuck's sake. What, am I actually supposed to use it for a particular part of this or can you use it without doing it? Because I've seen nothing that's made me need to cast it yet. Shields better, I'm guessing the one I've got buckle up gives one. This gives three. Okay. Should have come with a better shield, mate. You've been all right. Can't actually see any reason at all. If reach me in there for proving yourself worthy, Lithos instruction give a spell which will allow you to gain entrance to the Hollow Mount King. Is that where Lithos resides? You already know that, apprentice. Do not let your excitement cloud your mind. The hall is guarded by doors which no living creature may open. In order to gain entrance, you must raise a golem of the very element which is our lord, Lithos. A golem made of earth. Well, thank you, Basil Exposition. Listen carefully for the other necromancers. Will only tell you this spell once. Blood, bone, wood, dirt, black mark. Say the words of power in or elem. Then focus this magic upon a broad space of mud and the golem will be created. Seek out a stone cove. You should reach it by way of the catacombs. Once you've found stone cove, there you'll need to create your golem. Only this golem shall find and open the door which will stand before you. I understand, Necromancer. It's good that you do. Now we're gone. Go to the Mountain King. That ghost going to come back. Yeah, I think this just takes me out, doesn't it? Really? We'll stand death just for that. Oh, right. I'm actually up on the catacombs side, aren't I? Oh, right. Wet floor. Probably don't want to jump on there. Feck. Double feck. Triple feck. Feck all of you. The fuck? Uh, 
Hell's Vanish spell. Vanish, 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 vanish. Yeah, you're gonna kill me before I get a chance to do it. Very bad for business. How? When you got about one hit point left. Yeah, I can't remember where I uh, fell through the floor. To put me into the, seeing the necromancers. I can't remember where that was. At this very moment, Britannia burns. Better actually use a proper save point now. Uh, using quick saves. A bit of a Gandalf moment here. I have no memory of this place. I can't remember if I've fucking been here. Blah, leave me alone. Like Doom. Every architect laid to rest in his own plan. Yeah. I played all of them in order. Oh, yeah, I have been here. So I finished Tiltum, uh, uh, finished Serpent Isle three days ago. I think it was twelfth, four days ago. I did skip the two worlds of Ultima. I couldn't really face much more Ultima six, three times in a row. But uh, I never sure actually had any problem with Ultima nine. I never had any. Game stopping bugs. I never had any problems getting it going. Um, but I haven't tried to run it on, a, you know, a modern system in the last five years. So that'll be fun. But I'm sure I can get it to work. Yeah, I've been here. So, I need to find that building that I went into to fall through the floor. What is that thing? Does anybody know what that is? Yeah. I'm trying to think 
when did nine come out I can remember buying it the shop's not there now must have been was it 99 when uh, nine came out that sound about right 99 2000 I remember I can actually specifically remember buying certain alterners birthplace of Morians yeah I don't think I can go in there can I not yet anyway 